Forest covers over 80% of Gabon in Central Africa. It has extraordinary biodiversity, and researchers from the University of Stirling are using a new kind of camera trap in order to help monitor and maintain it. Biodiversity as a unit, however you choose to measure it, is important because it's part of the functioning of the Earth's global ecosystem. So I've been working in Gabon since 2018. And one of the striking features about Gabon is just how intact its wildlife and its ecosystems and its in general environment is. You know, it's a country pretty much the size of the UK, but it only has a population of about 2 million people. And it's just incredible. You walk around and there's just signs of wildlife everywhere. These cameras that we use are called camera traps and you, you essentially you strap them to a tree. We deploy the camera in the forest for up to three to six months and every time an animal walks by, it triggers the camera and we get a picture and we can collect hundreds of thousands or even millions of images. You know, the only way to extract meaningful information from that data is to either look at all of the images and say, okay, this image has got an elephant, this image has got a leopard, but that's extremely slow. So we have AI tools that we've been developing that actually can analyze those images and detect the species in the images automatically. These cameras detect the animal, we get a picture of the animal, and then instantly run the AI algorithm in the field and then send via satellite the, the species identification in the camera. So we can have our 200 cameras out in the field, in the forest, uh, and literally looking at our phone at WhatsApp or a map online, we can have real-time data telling us where elephants are, where buffaloes are, you name it. You know, the traditional model in ecology is that you deploy cameras or you deploy a sensor, you collect the data, you gather it back after some months, you analyze it over a period of six months, and then at the end of all that, you come up with a report and you say this is where your animals were. But by the time you do that report, you could be a year, two years, five years out of date. Gabon is home to the critically endangered forest elephant. So another potential use of these camera traps is to use them to detect poachers. We've been working with Hack the Planet in the Netherlands to develop a system that can give real-time data, for example, when it detects a human with a gun. And that data could be used by the National Parks Agency in Gabon to inform their anti-poaching activities. Biodiversity as a unit, however you choose to measure it, is important because it just is part of the functioning of the Earth's global ecosystem. You can't have forests that store carbon without the mammals that eat the, the fruits from the trees and disperse the seeds. You know, that's just one simple example. But all of those complex interactions are fascinating to understand and absolutely crucial for life on Earth as a whole.